when I started repairing um, cuckoo clocks, I started collecting clocks in 1999. My last year while being stationed over in England, I'm retired Air Force, and I got bit by the antique bug, the clock bug, whatever you want to call it. But I was too cheap to pay somebody to repair my clocks. I figured it out on my own through a VHS tape that I bought. Bruce Rasman, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that name wrong, um, but I watched that VHS tape over and over and over again, practiced, went back to the VHS tape. But when I, I bought a couple of cuckoo clocks back then, but when I went to repair the cuckoo clock, I thought to myself, this is such a cheap system, and I set it to the side. Well, after I re retired uh, because of disability issues, I, in 2019, I decided I was going to repair the clocks myself. Uh, I was going to uh, repair the cuckoo clock. So I bought a book, and uh, this is the book, the Cuckoo Clock Repair Manual, third edition, by William J. Billiger. There's some good things in the book, but my clock had a count wheel movement on it, and the book did not help me out with my clock. So I basically uh, was members of a few groups, met a few friends. Um, uh, Tyler Beavers, um, Christopher Sanchez, uh, a couple of other people. And um, I learned how to fix the clock myself. And so I was so proud of myself that I bought another clock and another clock and another clock. And before too long, I was answering questions in all these groups. And uh, people asked for me all the time. And I got tired of typing the same old answer over and over again. So I started putting videos on Facebook. Well, I live out in the country. My internet is slow. Facebook will not allow me to post a long video. So I started a YouTube channel because it allows me to post long videos. Uh, a year and a half later, I have over 800 subscribers. Um, and uh, I'm the admin for two different groups. I also have this book right here. It's called The Black Forest Cuckoo Clock by Carl Kochman. It's a good book. There's a lot of good information in this book. But the NAWCC has noted that there are several errors in this book. One error is um, a antique movement that they are saying it's a Gerbert Kerner. It has GK on it with a, uh, uh, an, uh, a Christmas tree. George Cool Patton, the GK and the uh, tree symbol uh, in January of 1909, I believe. But anyway, it's a good book. There are some other good books out there. Um, when I started repairing my cuckoo clocks in 2019, there weren't that many YouTube videos on how to repair cuckoo clocks. I've been told that I have the most YouTube videos out there on repairing cuckoo clocks, and that's why I should create this cuckoo clock repair video set for beginners. So that's what I'm doing.